Hey, yo, I don't listen anymore. I'm the literary staunch figure, visionary, more willing to cross the line and achieve victory. You've all witnessed. I'm sick of being a nice guy, now I'm all villain. Howling at the moon, devouring small children, small flowers as I move. In a power on their small whispers. Freaking midgets in the building talking tall business. I'm tired of liars, acting like they're white. Just yeah. pretend to speak a lot. Real heads keep a tight lip. Preach on the night shift, recognize the life list. Pick a side, I get fried with the mindless. Regardless of the rooms or the past, I'm a kingpin. A regular who peddles truth. Step up in the ring, kids. All I do is win win. All you do is talk shit. That's why I'm Prince of the Might, and you a fucking pain. Rumors circulate, sort of like the earth does. Perpetrate, devastate, leave you feeling worthless. But no, never hesitate when you got a purpose. Dig it like we underground and you ain't scratch the surface. My advice, quit talking, it's over. Everybody, this is the Gauntlet Guard Your Grill number two. Make some fucking noise. Yeah. Make some noise for Battle Rap. Know your numbers, they got the shit locked down for every league worldwide, like some geniuses and shit. They got some Rain Man counting cars shit going on, but they do know your numbers, so check out the battle side if you want to know who stands where and who's the real champ of what leagues for real. SMB Studios, Scribe Apparel, everybody make some noise. Yeah. One coin toss, still chose to go for 60 seconds when you're ready. Oh, did I introduce him on the left hand side? Make some noise for Oxide! Yeah. I'm not drinking, so I got a little fucked up. On the right hand side, make some noise for Lurks! Yeah. Lurks is going to be pressed in there, showing he's in the corner previously, so I expect this one to be a good one. Let's go. Uh, yeah. See, I walked away from my last battle with some mixed up thoughts, like some shit that I signed in a diary. But now that I come to think of it, that shit was kind of inspiring. See, the, critici the criticism Zane gave me lit a fire inside of me. Now watch me fucking explode like the Priory Dynasty. Yo, Lurks, when this shit's over, you're never gonna want to do it again. You'll be fine in sobriety. I'm gonna squash you like a grape that's left behind in a winery. When this battle's fucking over, you won't be hiding the irony, because I've got Lurks in the dark like a privacy bribery. It's not providing variety, this shit is animalistic. You want some vegetarian shit, I've got that cannibal instinct. So I hope you didn't sleep on me, because if you snooze, then you lose. Saying this motherfucker's legit, it's like saying that T-Dub doesn't buy his YouTube views. <laughs> so I'm gonna raise my fucking rifle, aim for the chest of the green target. Unlike you, I'm the future of this shit, like invest in a free market. And I don't do this shit for the reaction, as long as the real heads feel that connection. This is truly bars of a bullshit, I don't think you could deal with complexion. This is real, the ejection, I'll fucking steal your reflection. I'm a hungry up and come alert, and it's my next meal for selection. What am I this now? What am I this now? Oxide! Words cannot describe what I'll do to this cunt. I'll be creating that bloodshed like it's that time of the month. Seriously, this, I'll leave this kid in a critical condition. This battle for me is just a warm-up, like CO2 emissions. And Oxide, you have an ox nose and Oxide. You look like a junkie that's addicted to cockhide. I bet 50 shades of grey get this kid through cold summer nights and you couldn't flow tight if I dropped you in a narrow river at high tide. Some sort of retarded mole rat queen. <laughs> I bet he jacks horses off because he thinks he can get ketamine. <laughs> See, that just don't work, mate, and neither do you. You're not good at this. Let's just tell the truth. And I was gonna start oxing your mum in this battle, you know, to create some heat. But even though she is a fat cow, decided not to win the end because she's just not worth the beef. <laughs> Zuka and shoot you down during area flight. He wants to talk about me being a princess and let's talk about a fucking stereotype. See, I'll run up in your crib and start strongholding your granny, then I'll chase her down the street screaming, fuck your Mongolian family. Oh. 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 Speaking, speaking of your family, you're, 
Your family's probably in a factory. They descended my printed socks. And you're probably the reason I'm in my shoes. No pun intended to Twiz of Oz. Oh. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I'm freestyling this shit. I'll fucking run into a diner and shoot. My lines have more fucking poison in them than the spider on the roof. <laughs> but on some real shit though, yo, I'm flowing volcanic rocks. I'm a rare, rare fucking breed like no one Hispanic walks. I'ma hit you with the steel like I'm throwing mechanic props. I plant the seeds, it's that war shit like growing organic crops. But think about this shit. My attack will happen with velocity. Just admit it, you only spit funny shit. You don't know how to the art from the actual rapping to philosophy. And I don't give a fuck. I'll say that shit without compassion or apology, because he's just going to be another blend in the background like his fashion and photography. Word. It's on. When Twiz told me it was you I was battling outside, I went on your Facebook, had one look, and next minute it was offline. <laughs> see? You must have some pretty weird stuff to hide, because it's obvious you don't, you don't want me to see your shit. I could have done that as well. Fortunately, I'm not a bitch. I've got nothing to hide. I'm proud of who I am. I can't say the same for you though, but I understand you just didn't want me to view, so I couldn't build up my bars, which ultimately means you didn't want me to see how much of a faggot you are. Because oh, yeah. I know when I flow, everyone near will cremate. From that heat wave created by my line exploding like a grenade. There's none safe with these rhymes harder than duct tape, and you're fucked, mate. You couldn't get love even if it was your birthday. <laughs> and you want to know why? Cause you, Cause you look like you've been fucked up by drugs Walking around like you're half stuck That arrogant look on your face like you're a hard cunt But we both know that in any social situation You're fucked because you've got a face that even a mother couldn't love Whoa. And you must be pretty mad that your face looks like trash I swear it actually takes effort to look this fucking bad <laughs> no, 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 seriously mate You look so fucked up, you are beyond help You know what? Screw calling kids helpline, you should just kill yourself Let's get them hot over here Start with round three oh, fuck jokes Yo I could write this shit for days, where the fuck do I deposit the piles? I think it's quite clear by now to me and him we have completely opposite styles. Speaking of opposite, your name in reverse is Lurks. Not really. Your name in reverse is Scroll, and I think that that's a coincidence there. See, the Scroll are a fictional extraterrestrial race. It's what I'm about to say, yo, I think that it's fair. See, us tying into being opposite, yo, brother, it is clear that compared to me, just like them, I'm on another stratosphere. And I want to be the hot topic of this shit like debating equality. Your rhymes are just going to end up fucking worthless like an inflated economy. Man, I hope your mum gets punched in the face by a wallaby. <laughs> a fucking brown house and shit. You're probably a guy who uploads his songs to SoundCloud shit and then sends it to his faggot friends and they'll be like, Yeah man, that sounded legit. <laughs> and in reality, it was fucking messy like working at Diesel Works. I'm going to hit you in the back of the head, hear the sound of the needle burst. But there wasn't poison in that needle, more towards a lethal curse. Why the fuck should I be afraid of him? I've never been afraid to go where evil lurks. Speaking of songs, I heard your tracks outside. Most of it's irrelevant. You use large words just to try and just to try and sound intelligent. But your whack flow is evident, and your shitty delivery is prevalent. I mean, you say you're smart for your age, but you're just not getting it. See, now this is the only way you learn, so I'm just gonna be blunt. Using big words just aren't enough when your delivery and flow are awkward as fuck. It doesn't matter how many times you dub your voice, how many samples you use in your instrumental choice. What really matters is your bars, delivery and flow, and you've got none of those, which makes you a fucking joke. And I know you said those were just uh, demos and not complete, but how the fuck do you think yourself fit to make demos when you can't even hit a beat? And on your Facebook Oxide page it says, I make music for myself, and that's it. Well, ironically, you're the only one who would ever listen to that shit. <laughs> now, uh, let's just be honest, this industry is not for you. You're better off doing whatever it is you faggots do. I mean, go suck dick until you lose a tooth or go around and talk shit with your crew, actually. It doesn't matter how you make your next move because ultimately, in the end, you'll always be that faggot destined to lose.
get that real talk quality, that's the real shit that we love. Big ups SMD Studios, Scrapper Power, Battle Rep, Dolan Funk Design, DF Design, MJ Picks, any motherfucker that would like to give me props, I'll give them all back to you. Would you? <laughs> Preach would like to shout out Scrub Apparel by the way. Scrub Apparel motherfuckers, rip that shit, what up? Thank you. Yeah. 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 That battle was dope, judges gave it 3 nil. lurks. Yeah. What's up, it's for Ellen Productions, just watched Oxide vs Lurks. I think they both showed heaps of improvement. Put the second round, it's pretty even, but yeah, got to give it Lurks for overall in the first and third. What's up? Four, um, just watched Oxide vs Lurks, pretty tight battle for you know, two dudes I've seen before. Both come a long way since the last time I've seen them, that's for sure. Uh, first round I took notes on some nameless shit. Um, I gave the first round to Lurks just by a slight edge, he had some hard hitting lines. Uh, Oxide was dope, but he, had, he got just outdone slightly. Uh, second round, Oxide had that little stumble. Uh, he caught, brought it back with the freestyle reference to Spider Hanger from the roof, which was cool. Uh, but Lurks started off with a lot of filler, but he brought it back in the end, so I give that one to Lurks just by a slight bit, only due to the stumble. Third round, I actually preferred Oxide's uh, third round. Lurks, he had one big thing leading up to one punch, but it could have been a lot better and it seemed a lot filler and not that much shit, so I gave that to Oxide, but in the end I gave it two to one to Lurks, but only just by a tiny bit. Uh, what up, it's Rifle, we're at the Baytown, we're on South now. Uh, I just watched Lurks versus Oxide. I'm gonna give that one to Lurks. I'll probably give the last round to Oxide, but I have to give it to Lurks just on uh, presence and how hard his bars were hitting. Real impressive for a gauntlet battle. That, that was huge. So, Lurks, to it. And guess what else? This just came to me. What? We're making a music video. Yeah.